Hey guys, welcome to Tropical Ants. This is our introduction video. So guys, this channel is about ants and ant keeping. I will be giving you short tutorials on ant keeping and I will be helping you make the most out of your ant keeping experience. Let me just show you all my ant colonies. Here we have a young colony, a founding stage colony of Solenopsis geminata, also known as red tropical fire ants. Let's just take a look inside. So you see here they are not too big, actually they are pretty small. Uh, they have only have 8 to 10 workers. I think this colony is about 3 weeks old and as you can see there are only a few workers. So the big ant in the middle is the queen ant. I think there are about 8 to 10 workers. Here is a quick bird's eye view. Sorry guys the bird's eye view was very short. These ants are super active and they will try to get out every chance they get. The next queen ant is of the species Campanotus dolendus. So she has some brood of eggs and larvae. This queen ant is really huge and is about 30 millimeters in size. Here's a bird's eye view. Since she's all alone, she doesn't try to escape and goes back to her brood. So the next species of queen ant is actually an unknown species, but I guess it's Chromatogaster. But I can only tell for sure once the workers come out. If you know which species this queen ant is, please let me know down in the comments. I'm actually hoping that this queen ant will give us a colony. Here is a bird's eye view. You can see the brood pile pretty clearly. I don't know why she is keeping her eggs away from the moist spots. Maybe she prefers a dry nest. Here you can see the pupae. This is a queen ant of the species Odendromachus hematodus. You can see some brood over here. Take a look at your mandibles. Those are really huge and can snap shut lightning fast. There's a lone egg over here. You can see the insect leftovers from her previous feeding. Thank you guys for watching and please be sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos.